Uh, pretty much just trying to keep uh, plenty under control with regards to the fires. Uh, it sparked up uh, the day before yesterday and we've been out in the field for about 26 hours now. No sleep, no rest. And yeah, the fire just ran like wildfire. Huh? Um, so it, it started yesterday afternoon and then it progressed? How yeah, did it progress? Yeah, just I think with the wind. Uh, huge, huge speeds of wind. It just headed down the coastline um, and it just distracted everything that came across the bay. It just took everything out. Huh? And um, how did you keep yourself motivated? Why didn't you give up? I think it's because it's our town and it's the people of our town. And Plet is a very tight-knit community. And uh, it's an amazing place. I've never met a town that will pull together like that. I think within about 10 minutes we had probably 60 community uh, volunteers that were helping us assist getting people out of the different locations and stuff. So yeah. And you don't know about how many people displaced or anything like that in those moments? Um, yeah, actually this hall right behind you we had about 30, 40 um, people that were evacuated. Then it got too small so we moved to Plett Primary School and we probably had about 100, 100 150 uh, members of the different communities that we had uh, brought out.